Some residents of Ilori, the crusted capital, are counting their losses after a rainstorm destroyed properties worth several millions of naira. Correspondent Ibrahim Alige has details. I don't know what to do because all my livelihood is in shambles. I'm sorry that I'm being emotional. It's everything. An obviously distraught farmer. Lieutenant Colonel Abubakar Edo retired from the Nigerian Army in 2015 after serving his fatherland for 23 years. He used his retirement entitlements and savings to go into full scale farming, animal husbandry, and crop farming. But last week's rainstorm dealt a massive blow on his investment. Most of the structures and the farm, including the two big hen houses and fish archery, collapsed totally. Because I don't know what I can get out of the whole thing. Because all the 22, 23 years I put in the service of the nation, all the little I was able to get at, I invested in infamy. So I don't even know where to start from. Sincerely speaking, I don't know where to start from. Because all the little I got out for the past 23 years is what I can see in pieces now. I'm in total disarray. I don't know how to express myself. The state government has sent a delegation to the firm and is hopeful that help will soon come its way. After this engagement, this is my main source of income. And this is what all my children and my family depended on. So seeing everything crumble, I don't know, I don't know. But I believe God will intervene. I believe God will come into my rescue. At Ansaru Islam Secondary School, Ogidi Ilori, virtually all sections of the school are affected, including the staff quarters. Majority of the students of this school are science students, but the rainstorm destroyed their laboratories and ICT room. It is a setback for students preparing for their final examinations, and it is necessary that the classes are fixed before they resume for another term. This is not the first time that buildings within Ansar Islam Secondary School Ogidi Ilori will be destroyed by rainstorm. In fact, it's become an annual tragedy, and finding a lasting solution is indeed sacrosanct. Ibrahim Alige, TVC News, Ilori.